Hello guys, today I'm going to talk about how to import extra fonts into your Angular application. For example, this audio script from Google Fonts. Uh, the first step is to download the files. Download family. Um, you will be able to get a zip file. Uh, once you unzip it, unzip, you will find these two TTF files, audio script to bold and audio script to regular, two different fonts. And you need to extract these two files under your assets folder uh, because assets folder is just like public folder for Express JS. Angular's asset folder houses files that can be accessible by client by the front end. So here I have the assets folder. I create a subfolder called font. Then I put these two TDF files under this fonts folder. And the next thing I need to do is to go to my uh, global style sheet or whichever style sheet you want to use uh, the font for. Um, just one SAS directive, SCSS directive. At font face, the first line is font family. You name it whatever. I name it Olio. And the next line is code has a property has two uh, parts. The first is URL. The second was format. So URL is just assets, fonts, Olio script to regular. So wherever you extract those files. And the format is true type. With these four lines of simple code, you will be able to use this font anywhere under the name Olio. So here I create a new class called Olio Font Family Olio. Uh, Olio class. In my template, I just use this class equals Olio. So it's super easy, right? Download the file, extract them under your assets folder, and then use these four lines of code to name it. And then you can just use it whichever way you want, like creating an extra class. And here is the end result. I can see the audio font here, um, reactive form with the nested form groups. Uh, so it's very easy. Okay, thank you.